Good morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever and whenever you find yourself. Fudge Dice Roll here, and we are back in the Valley of the Old Farm on Farming Simulator 22. Hope you guys are doing great. We just finished... Well, there's uh, there's a couple little spots down here I can still try to hit. Uh, but we are, for the most part, finished with uh, getting the field mulched after... Our soybean harvest, our mighty soybean harvest. Let's go ahead and drop this here. A couple little spots. Uh, I think there's, yeah, probably a few more this way. So, but yeah, we uh, we got the field mulched up nice, so this should give us an additional like a, uh, I think it's a two and a half percent yield. It doesn't sound like much. I'll give you that. But in the grand scheme of things, we'll take every little bit we can. You know what I'm saying? I think you know what I'm saying. Um, ooh. We, yeah. Here we go. Yum, yum, yum. Mulch, mulch, mulch. There we go. Isn't that pretty? All right. Well, we have gotten our Massey here sufficiently filthy. We'll go ahead and run this back up to the farm. Oh, yeah, look at that. She is dirty. And we do have some farm chores to get done with her today, mostly being mucking out the cow pasture. Uh, well, the cow barn, rather. The cow barn's got to get mucked out uh, because... Oh, are we going to... Oh, I pressed... <laughs> I, I pressed the wrong button. Like, an, like, a, like a real goobus. But, uh, no, so we need to get up here. We need to get the... Uh, the manure mucked out of the cow barn and we will be we'll be running the planter today we went and picked up our pottinger uh terrasem and there she is right there hooked right up to the old john deere 8r series love it love it love it uh wiped out all of our money <laughs> all of our money we've already done a few of our little more menial chores uh, i brought back the uh We'll just take this to the wash rack, and we'll do a quick once-over. Uh, I've put things back in their homes for the most part. For the most part. Uh, we got got the, the cloths and everything put away. Kind of maneuvered a few things around. Here we are. We'll go ahead and give this old girl a clean look at. Look at her. Absolutely filthy. But, yeah. So, here we are. We're going into our going into winter we're in uh october 2 right now and uh, i mean i could turn the hud back on for a moment i kind of been enjoying playing the game without the hud i think it just looks so much cleaner there are obviously times where i run the hud uh, especially kind of between montage modes just to make sure that uh you know things are are going right uh especially if i'm if i'm running like uh, the guidance steering uh, I'm still not super duper familiar with it, and sometimes I, I want to make sure that like I'm staying in my lines and what have you. So let's go ahead and get everything here nice and clean. I mean, we're about to get this all dirty again by mucking out the, uh, the the poo, the manure, and getting that loaded into our manure spreader, which is going to be great. Uh, because I have a feeling we're going to get to use that guy, and how something else we're going to. I need to do is also lime, and I don't know if I even have the money to do that. I know I'm going to need to because I know my pH isn't great in some spots. Um, ooh, Vasa Uh Oh, look, it's another little manure spreader. This one's cute. Look at this a little guy. This Varofex. Look at that. Oh, if we were running a real small farm, this would be great. Look at that little guy. 12K, too. Not that expensive. Uh, holds about 5 cubic meters of manure. Has an 8 meter spread. Oh, that's pretty nice, actually. That's pretty nice. Um, Let's see here. Fertilizer spreaders is what we need, right? We need a lime spreader here. Yeah, man. 45K. We can't swing that. We're not going to be able to lime the field. pH is going to be off. Uh, we can get the nitrogen levels where they need to get to. pH is going to be off. Ah, man, that just blows. That blows. 
because that means we're not gonna be we're not gonna be farming at our full potential. What are you gonna do though? I mean, we're also not we also don't have the money to get like a fuel roller or anything like that either. But it is what it is. So uh, let's see. Let us see. So I can go ahead and muck this out a little bit more. I don't know. That's looking pretty full. How full are you? Uh, it's got a pretty fair amount of, uh, uh, of of manure in it. I would think. I would wager. Would hazard a guess. Uh, I'm not going to be able to pull and operate this with the Massey, but I can... I was going to say I can hook up real quick and see, but you know what? You got to turn the HUD on there, Fudge. <laughs> you got to toggle the HUD on, buddy. 88%. Okay, honestly, that's pretty good. Um, let's go muck the, uh, let's go muck out the cow, the, the, the cow barn here right quick. How much manure are we running in here? Uh, oh, you know what? Man, it ain't even really worth doing. Yeah, never mind. Ain't really that much in there. Okay. Well, here's the plan then. I need to run some more hay in for the cows. If we take a look at their food, their food's sitting a little low. So let's go grab a bale and our bale uh, our bale attachment. We'll run we'll run a, a hay bale in for the cows, right? So we're gonna go ahead and get the field prep today, and that's gonna be a that's gonna be long. So we're gonna get it planted. We've already got it mulch prepped. Uh, we're gonna get it planted, then we're gonna get manure spread. So that's gonna be a lot of that going on. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let's drop you here. Ah boop boop boop. Ah boop 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 boop. <laughs> I hope you guys are doing great. Uh, I'm doing I'm doing pretty good. I was I was not feeling so great. Uh, I was feeling sick a few days back. Just uh, just really low energy. Just super duper duper tired. But I'm feeling a little bit better today, which is nice. But uh, and still a little congested. Still a little uh, nasally. But that's just allergy season for you. I need a work a little bit on my like my 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 sleep hygiene for uh, allergy season there's some things that i i need to do um okay so we'll go ahead and grab ourselves down a round bale of hay thank you that's right there for us to go grab with our grabby claws and go take to the cows Yoink. look you just got to give it a little hug Right. Yep. <laughs> uh, so I am still looking into trying to get some eye tracking set up here with my webcam because what I would like to do is I would like to start to be able to do a little bit more in cab, uh, a little more often. I think the in cab looks really nice. Ah, sorry about that. I, I think the in cab looks really nice, and I think it, it just kind of adds to uh, the immersion. <laughs> so. By being able to play uh, in cab and uh, turning the HUD and stuff off, and being able to have eye tracking, so I can kind of look around more naturally, it'll uh, it'll be it'll be pretty good in my opinion. So here he goes, go little cows, eat up your your delicious delicious hay. Or is this not in the right spot? Do I need to shift it a little bit more this way? A little bit more this hay. Is that? Yeah, it's gone. There we are. Okay, I'll get out and close this. And they got uh, 20, uh, 20 cubic meters of, of hay in there, so. All right, uh, we should be pretty good then. Where do I wanna park you off? Um, so let's go ahead and just plip plop you over here, huh? You can just sort of there's not much I can do with you right now let's just kind of we'll tuck you way back here just for now just for now 
That's nice and crooked in there, ain't it? Yeah. You, uh, you ever driven before, Fudge? Uh, not too terribly often, but... <laughs> Alright, so, we have our TerraSim here. In all of its expensive glory. So it can only hold 1,600 liters of seed because the other, like... 2,400 liters is uh, set aside for fertilizer. Uh, so that kind of bums me out. But we brought back plenty, plenty of seed. You know, as you remember at the end of last episode, we bought like three bags full. All right. Let me just kind of get this snugged up on here under the field. And get this thing ready to do the planting um yeah so so we're gonna be going for a wheat field i mean honestly be wheat is great because we'll be able to use that to feed chickens but i would not mind oats if you know what i mean <laughs> but here we are so we're at the end of october this can be our last plant um and then we'll go from there. Man, this oilseed radish would have been nice to put in as a green fertilizer. Alfalfa, we could still plant into November. I'm. It'd be nice to have another field that I could plant some alfalfa in. But that's fine. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get that that little montage mode going. So yeah, uh, I will. I will we'll, we'll cut to that in a moment here. <laughs> Uh, what is the width on you real quick before I forget? Six meter working. Okay. All right. We're going to get into montage mode, guys. So let's set up for that.
right, so we went ahead and cleaned up a few of the areas that were missed. But yeah, check this out. We we managed to do it. We managed we managed the field. We still have a little bit of seed here. So we had 1,600 liters, so that's not bad. Oh, we still have this little bit of a spot right here. I wonder if we can get this. Hold on. I thought I got that. I don't know if this counts as... Do you count or not? Right here, you? A little bit. It says wheat. Hmm, I'm not sure. Oh, you know what? This might have just been from turning. This might have just been from turning. All right, pH value is bad. Nitrogen value is way bad. There's nothing we can do about the pH value. That's what really sucks. Uh, expected yield right now is saying 82%. All right, that bums me out a little bit, 82%. However, we can fix the issue with the, uh, with the, with the, the nitrogen. pH, really nothing we can do about unless, unless we take out a loan. Now, I never specifically said that we couldn't take out a loan. And I know plenty of farmers IRL that you know have taken out loans to get equipment and stuff I just uh, man I don't want to be in debt that's the thing so I can't lease equipment but I you know can I take out a loan is that a thing oh hold on let me just go ahead and drop I mean there's no I mean there's no point in cleaning up the John Deere yet but but our planter actually I'll reconnect it so I can Park it over there near the, uh, well, this is a cedar. I use that term so interchangeably, but we're going to go ahead and park our cedar over here by our planter. There's no point in washing you yet. You're going to just be going right back out to the field, dug at dirty. So, let's, this is going to be a heavy turn. Ooh. There we are. And... Just do one of these numbers. My dog is booping me with her head right now because she wants love. <laughs> uh, I gave her a bunch of big snugs earlier today, and they just weren't enough. They're never enough when you have a needy, needy dog. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead. Flippity plop up here, and... Now, this is going to be interesting because this thing throws a, like, a 24-meter, uh, like, coverage area. So, I'm not sure how this is going to work. It's my first time running uh, a manure spreader. I'm not going to, I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. It's my first time running a manure spreader. It's going to be very interesting. Uh, let's take a look at this here. Um... We'll leave the automatic application rate on. I don't think I need to change the nitrogen reference value because we're, uh, okay. We're, we're here. Okay, so how does this work? I don't want to turn on the manure spreader, but I want to unfold it, yes. Okay. Uh, now I'm not sure how it throws manure out. Oh, okay. It throws it from the back. Throw it from the back. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I just want to make sure that I'm in a good spot for this. 24. All right. I think this will definitely be a course play kind of a thing. I know. I know. You're like, oh, fudge. Why don't you do it yourself? Well, look. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. That's why. Um. This is 24 meters. I don't think I need three headlands on 24 meters. I can get away with a headland. Um, do a course generator. Generate the field work. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Let's uh, let's get out here and sling some poo, eh? You know what I'm saying? All right. Let's see how this looks.
All right, it's gonna line us up. Are you lining us up on? Should be lining us up on the the starting position for the field. I'm confused. Okay, hold on. Um. Ooh, and here we go. Flying and poo. All right. Oh, okay. Oh. Look at all that manure. Wow. That's a lot. Hopefully we have enough in the uh, the vehicle here. It looks like it's kind of burning through a little bit there in the front pretty quickly. I really hope we have enough manure. Yeah, it looks like it's dissipating quite fast. That has me nervous. That has me very nervous. I mean, the coverage is, is, is huge, so. But yeah, that has me a little bit nervous there. Oh wow, we can almost cover this whole section down here. Wow, look at that. Throwing that hot steamy poo. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That is, that's running low. Oh, we're not gonna have enough manure for the whole field, are we? Man, just issue after issue right now. All right, all right. Oh, you're gonna fling poo in a pretty nice, okay, pretty nice pattern there. Yeah, we're not gonna have enough. I mean, I'll be surprised if we have enough for this pass. Hmm. Oh, that does not bode well for the field. Oh yeah, we're not even gonna finish this pass off. Ugh. Dang, 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 dang. This is not going to be a super profitable yield. Yeah, wow. Yep. All right, we're going to need to have a lot of manure in the future. Dang, that is... All right, well, you saw it here first, folks. Uh, we're not going to be able to manure this whole field. Oof, 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 oof. What to do, what to do, what to do. I don't think there's anywhere on the map where one can buy manure, is there? Um, I don't think there is. Manure, manure, where can I buy the poo poo? Nope, there's nowhere to buy it. There's places using it, there's nowhere to buy it. All right, uh, huh. what to do? Let's go ahead and turn the, uh, HUD back on. So, nitrogen value there. Meh. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. Hold on. Hold on. The manure helped to bring up the pH value as well. Nitrogen says it's okay. Expected yield 92% there. 91. 89. 87. 82. 80. Okay. Manure is going to bring up our pH and our nitrogen value. Okay, so basically we just need to have a lot more cows. That's what it is. We just need to have a lot more cows. All right. Well, you know, you live and you learn, right? Ain't nothing to it but to do it. So this is not going to be a super high yield wheat crop. But... It's not going to be terrible at the same time because we do have a pretty, we have, we have a pretty, I mean, 80% is still good, but it's not great, man. It's not great, but we're still going to be able to get straw out of it, which we'll be able to use on the farm and, uh, and that, you know, that, that's good. That's good. All right, let's go ahead and maneuver you back into your spot. Back here. Right. 
Tighten it up, tighten it up. There we are, there we are, there we are. Uh, okay, we're just going to have to stay on top of filling this bad boy up with uh, good old poo, right? Oh, all right, let's go ahead and clean off the old uh, the old John Deere. There ain't going to be nothing to it but to just sort of wade our way through it, right? Now, we're going to have some weeds to contend with, and we could probably go ahead and run the weeder now. With the old Massey Ferguson. Uh, oh, whoops. I accidentally hit the wrong button. Well, I hit two buttons at the same time because I got these big chubby digits. <laughs> A fat finger to the buttons, I do declare. Oh, uh, you know what I should do? I should. Uh, every time. I always feel so conflicted about hunting for. Uh, hunting for collectibles you know what I'm saying I feel so conflicted about doing that because part of me is like it's cheaty Pete and the other part of me is like but they're on the map so I mean in a real life you uh, as a farmer would be like oh I found this pigeon statue and now I'm gonna make fifty thousand dollars but you know I'm also not a real farmer right now at least I don't know, guys. We might see in the future. We, we might, we might see. <laughs> uh, turn off all the lights. There we go. There we go. There we are. Let's park you back here. Uh, this is just. This seems to be the de facto spot for the John Deere. <laughs> so, all right. Uh, we can go jump in the Massey. Ugh, man, such a bummer. It's such a bummer. We just had enough for that one little section, man. We didn't even get a full headland of the field. But look at that. I mean, all right. We, we're like, pH value is going to be good. Nitrogen value is going to be good. So manure is the way to go. So we just need more cows. We just need more baby cows. How are we looking right here on cows? They're at 60% reproduction, right, meow? I wonder. What if I bought 10 more cows? Like, they're going to give birth to 10. What if we bought 10 more? And we just put 10 more in here now. I think we might do that. I think we might grab... So we got these brown Swiss. But I want to when I want to mix in some Holsteins... If I mixed in some Holsteins. I think we'll do that. I think we'll grab a few more cows. We'll grab 10 more cows. It's going to cost us... Oh, that's so much money. We don't really have that much money. We don't really have that. That would be 16K. Man. Ugh. This is rough. This is rough. We do not have a whole lot of finances. All right. All right, all right, all right. If I was going to take out a loan... To get a roller, that loan to take out to get the roller would be about 20k. But the roller would give me another two and a half percent yield on the field, which means that the areas over here that are like 80% would be like 82, 83 percent. Oh, these are that's 86, 87. Okay, yeah, so they'd be closer to like all right, 83. It'd be like 85 to 90. So we'd be really close. I just don't want to take out a loan. All right. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and call it here. Um, I'm going to run the Massey to weed. I'm going to run the Massey to weed the ground preemptively so that we don't have to worry about any weeds popping up and then we're going to do that thing that we do where we just kind of skip ahead month by month by month until there's some action happening so oh man i'm just kind of man i'm like really bummed out i was really hoping we we're going to be able to uh, oh this is on here the other way derp <laughs> derp um I was really, really hoping that we were going to have uh, enough manure. But when I started seeing how fast it was going, I knew. I knew. 
It was not going to be the case. All right. Come on. Back, back, back it up. All right. Well, I think this is a great spot to go ahead and leave off. This is going to be maybe a little bit of a shorter episode. But I hope it was still entertaining nonetheless. If it was, please consider leaving a like, a comment, and a subscribe. And, uh, and, and just a reminder, guys, just a reminder, over 70% of you who are viewing this content are not subscribed. And I tell you, it would mean the world to me if you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It helps out so much, so much. You don't even know. Uh, I would love to get to the point where I could partner my channel and just run a little ad at the end of the video so that your boy could make a few dollars off of it. It would be phenomenal if you would go ahead and tickle that subscribe button, hit that like button. I would appreciate it so very much. I know I've mentioned it before. I don't really like mentioning it, but I am disabled. This is a nice way for me to make a few extra dollars on the side. I would appreciate it. So if you can and you haven't already, hit that subscribe, hit the like. I greatly appreciate it. Until next time, guys, I'm Fudge Dice Roll. You are amazing. I love your face. And I will catch you in the next one. Fudge Dice Roll. Signing off.